color-coded Rainbows are party favors Just take off, I'll see you later Unless I'm still going Not empathetic Sure, I've tried and still don't get it Right now I feel like I do But who wouldn't on the moon Sunbathing eyes See the reflection of Earth in your eyes It's not like in the movies at all No surprise We, yes I said we I get beside myself sometimes It's like a work of art Forbidden fruits that we indulge in Told me hold out my tongue and I swear Can't put heaven in the focus Playing all our hearts, chords I've never heard a song quite like this one It's new, I have to tell our kids How I did drugs for I did drugs for I did drugs for you. Color coded, rainbows, the prison laser. Can't find my phone, I'll get it later. Keep it a key 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 but a bucket seats in a 65. They used to be her dance, pride and joy. What do you think about these windows? Fuck this close to the Hollywood sign. Stargazing eyes, see the reflection of Mars in your eyes. It's all right to leave our physical forms down here like this And we, yes I said we, but I'm not beside myself this time You'll be my work of art Petals of roses, fields, fields and orchards Forbidden fruits that we indulge in Told me hold out my tongue and I swear It but heaven in the focus Playing on our hearts, chords I've never Song quite like this one, it's new. I have to tell our kids how I did drugs for. I did drugs for. I did drugs for you. Hello. uh hello 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 oh my gosh testing one two three howdy hi um hello there it's me tina i've returned from the dead actually i don't it's not i, I streamed yesterday didn't i did i did i did i i did a little bit huh like a little bit yesterday i just it, it was so small i, I hardly remember Nay, thanks for the four months, and it's gonna be another small one today. So, is that a Miku shirt? <laughs> it is. <laughs> it is a Miku shirt. Oh, paper cranes and big big. Thanks for the two months. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh. Um, I I'm a little nervous because people are like waiting for something, and I'm like, oh, I don't know what you're waiting for. Uh, <sighs> 37 months. I did, did, uh, sweats. Given the amount of like. And I'm like, oh god, I just, um, I'm, I don't know. Cause I was gonna draw pictures maybe or something. But I feel like you guys are looking Twitch for something. Oh. So I'm a little nervous about that bit. Oh, uh, Gabe, thank you for the 28 months. Thank you. It's because I haven't, um, oh my god. I just saw straight down my armpit. Also, this sleeve has a, 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 has a tiniest little hole in it. So I want to learn how to sew so I can fix this shirt. I think I'm going to practice sewing on it. <laughs> but, yeah. I, I, I think a drawing stream would be fun. But then I don't want people to get upset because they didn't get what they came here for. But I just know that if I um if I if I go now, 
and you guys are expecting for something. I don't know if I'm mentally prepared for all that. And I also don't know if um I'm gonna be able to do any of the quests, really. <laughs> so I'm like, oh. You know, I just, I just worry about stuff like that. Also, I posted on Instagram today. I have been just waiting a little bit because I, I don't know if I really like it that much, but I did it anyways because I've got a quota to meet this year and I'm already behind on my TikTok quota, so. <laughs> Woo! Tis what tis. Um, art stream. Yeah, maybe one. Maybe a little. Oh, yes, thanks for 17 months. Thank you. Um, but yes, posted a little, little IG post. If you could do your girl solid, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Because Instagram changes every day and I don't understand it anymore. I literally like, I think in the comments, I was like, oh, forgot to tag Broden. That's my bad. I'm so sorry. And someone was like, you can change it. And I was like, since when? Since when were we allowed to do that? I just feel like they're constantly changing stuff and I don't understand it. I don't get it anymore. It's different all the time. It's different. Um, uh, what are you gonna draw today? Oh, literally anything. Anything is the goal. Anything. You've been able to edit a tag for years? Oh my. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, we could do a little staker drawing, maybe. <laughs> She's getting older. I just like, I don't know. Instagram changes fast. I feel like, I feel like I've seen them crank out more updates for IG. Did you ever draw the thing from Christmas? No, well, that's why I was like, I need to draw today and practice because I can't draw this commission and suck. Especially cause you know, the commissioner opted for traditional, and that's not my, um... It's not my forte, so I, I'm i gonna have to get better. Listen, there's a reason why I don't do commissions, and it's because I take 50 years, okay? Because I do- it take 50 years. And this is- it's- this is so real. Oh my god. I haven't drawn since last time. Is there a deadline? Um, there isn't. I believe, but it's oh, traditional. Tina. Oh, you open stream because it's a requirement to have dinner with foolish <laughs> and Leslie. Didn't ya? Um, my lucky number. well, not exactly. Like I've been meaning to stream all day, but then I, I kept tying up loose ends, I suppose. Hiya. Thank you, Camille, for the three months. Uh, graphic and Kate crumbles. Thank you, but you know, like uh, dinner would be nice, but. E if I wanted to do a minimum of two hours, I've already missed dinner. Which is sad. Flip setting. Wow, that's a lot of months. Oh, sorry, Jen, thank you. I've like I don't know, I just basically did some things that I had to do for a while now. Um I don't know. I do feel like um, posting on Instagram takes me a while. Like, I'm just sitting there figuring it out. I'm like, I don't know which one's good or not. And then, you know, every time I post on Instagram, like, I sit there and I read the comments as they roll in. Because, you know, I try to, like, like see stuff and, and, and do little chuckles and, like, see the things that you guys write. I feel like it keeps me, like, in touch a little bit, you know. Otherwise, I just throw it into the abyss. Yeah. Um, all right, let's see. Let me open up. Oh, thank you, Pauline. Thank you. Um, let's see. Uh, I did actually go live, but perhaps not, not for supper, but because I've been meaning to and I just procrastinated all day. All day, I suppose. Where is this thing? Oh, wow, it's like buried. Okay. <gasps> Wait, am I even connected to... Six months, ah! <laughs> oh, hello! Um, oh, Karen, thanks for the six months! Thank you! And one Lucy, thanks for the one year! Thank wow, so much for thanks, the guys! They mean a lot to me, comfort streams? Yeah, this one should be on the comfier end. Okay, I guess since we've figured out that it's drawing... Uh, I, f I wish I tweeted. Okay, I shouldn't tweet out 
my stream until I know what I'm doing first. Because otherwise, it's just... I don't know. I feel like it just leaves people into the abyss. Hi, and they don't really know what they're tuning everyone. into. Oh, Sugar Puff, thanks for the 31 months. Thanks. And Pika, thanks for the 37. Wowie. Um. Oh. Uh. Just, just a second, guys. It's connecting. It's connecting. Um. Just say your life, Shrugs. Well, I mean, I do. Half the time. Oh. Happy to be here another month. Um. Oh, well, Valeria, thank you. Thank you. Please. Wait. Where is it? Sorry, the app is a little finicky sometimes. Okay, connect, please. Pray G. Connect, connect. I did it. Yay! Um, long live tomorrow or Monday? I, I don't know exactly what's happening tomorrow but monday there's a live potentially as well honestly once people are outside of my house like gone there's i feel like i'll probably be a degenerate again but right now i'm i, I live life too much it's a problem i suppose candle deco well i usually have it lit way over there but I was like, I'll just pe keep it on the background because I was like lighting it at my desk and I was like, I was actually closer to just put it over there. It's not connecting. Oh, unable. Why? Why is this? <gasps> Why? 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 Are you drawing? Yes, I draw. Yum, yum. Oh, I have a fun little detail about my, um, the reason why I picked the dress that I wore for streamer awards, guys. Oh. Oh, Moon Child, thanks for the four months. And, uh, Tori, thank you for the 21. Um, oh, thank you for the flower. Emslin, thank you. Um, but, uh, if this thing would just connect already. But basically, I was like, oh, you know... Since I'm a Minecraft nominee this year, I would like to pay tribute to my Minecraft skin. So I picked the same shade of purple. It's not that serious. Kirk Dog, thanks for the 26 months. And I got chrome nails to symbolize iron armor because I'm poor. <laughs> That's all. And chrome shoes. <laughs> I wanted to do more, but I ran out of time, like always. I always I just ran out of time and I was like, okay, this is what I have. This is I'll make do with what I can. But I kind of wanted like a little. I wanted more like chrome accessories, but it was really hard to find stuff like that last minute. Oh, please connect, please. I'm begging you. Please. You deserve netherite nails. Oh, netherite. That would be nice. Oh, it's working. Okay. <gasps> Anon, thanks for the five gifted. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you so much. All right. Um. Okay. Just making sure. Your stream background is cozy. Oh, thank you. It's t It took a while to evolve, honestly. It took a bit. It took a, it took a moment. <laughs> I have been enjoying this song, like, a lot. Ah, uh, silly. Silly Mog. Thanks for the tier one. Mog. Isn't... The word Mog is, like... Like, it, it feels kind of new for me. But it also feels mean. Have you guys heard of that word before? Um, okay. Alright. It's not that- Oh, okay. I was about to say. I don't know. I think it's like when someone's like- I don't know. When you say like, I, I like, mogged them or something. It means like, 
you looked better than them or something like that but it's just so mean like i was like why why is your purpose trying to like why are you trying to show up somebody like that is mean that is a mean thing to do focus on yourself <laughs> i don't like it i don't like that word it is it's so mean <laughs> i'm not a fan oh my god i remember this you know this was fun <laughs> a fun little time it's just my initials. Oh, I see. Oh my god, your initials mog people. That's crazy. Mm. This is foolish. Is um, it's where he came from. That's him inside. <laughs> uh. Okay. I haven't drawn since this day, so I'll have you know it's been a while for me. I'm a little nervous. But I need to draw because I would like to retain this this um this skill that I hardly nurture, you know. Um. Oh God! Like my hands are cold. I'm gonna sit on them real quick. Ugh. Freezing. So bright. What are you drawing? I'm not too sure. But if you like to draw, now's your chance to draw with me. We're picking up our pencils, you know? AI has nothing on us. <laughs> I hate AI. I really do. It's so upsetting. Like, I think, um... Oh, dude, like, just seeing the videos... I'm mortified. It, it's scary how good it is because I think there's something to remember with AI is like right now is is it's not gonna get worse than right now you know it's just gonna get better which is just so it's it is invasive and upsetting and I just feel like people shouldn't have to question whether something's like artificially made or not you know i think there's a world where ai can be good you know but i don't think ai should be doing the jobs that like are for people you know what i mean like ai was supposed to do the stuff we didn't want to do not the arts or like the things that like make life enjoyable, you know? That's like for us. That's for us, damn it. Greenelli thinks that 15 months. It's also just like, there's, you know, the laws are behind. So behind. It's not being regulated right now. And the way people train AI is like, how do you do it in a way that's like ethical? You know, like it has to be consensual, right? If you're going to train the AI on like media, like I feel like the media you give it has to be like, you have to consent to having your work, like, trained with. Mm. I digress. It's fine. Whatever. Um. Uh. Let's see. I bought fake cigarettes today. <laughs> I always draw this face by default. Cause they just look fun. <laughs> like, like in terms of like, maybe like pictures or something. I have this one from Name Your Price. And I was just like, it just like like maybe for like a picture-esque thing 
you know? I was like, oh, this could be cool. But you can't light them. They're fake. It's for props, like old school Hollywood prop aesthetics. But I did buy them. And I didn't want to keep putting my mouth on the, uh, my, the memorabilia that I had, the Name Your Price one. It was for, from Name Your Price Miami, I believe. <laughs> but it's, it's, you know, but I was like, oh, I'll just have those. She spent a week with the French guy and started buying cigarettes. Okay, to be clear, I don't think at all smokes at all. Let's, uh. Um, okay. Ramp. Um, let me think. Uh, what? Oh. Yeah, he also, yeah, he also doesn't drink. Oh. Greetings from Chile. There's a lot of people here that really appreciate you. Oh. What, what the heck? Thank you. And thank you for the three months as well. Kind, kind of you. Um. Yeah. Maybe I want it to be more outward. I can't tell how I want this. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll, you know, I'll just keep it like that for now. I'm gonna. I have to message the house group chat. Please don't have supper without me, guys. Please, 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 please. I, I, I want dinner too. Oh my god, I can't type. I can't type. My na my nails. I can't type. I can't type. They're throwing knobby around. Okay, good. Keep them distracted. Ugh. All right, let's see. Um. Um. Okay, she can have like kind of a Oh my god, I don't remember how this works. Maybe if I actually studied bodies and stuff, it'd be fine. Instead of constantly drawing exaggerations, you know? Ugh. What do you mean before supper? I don't know. I might have to change my title. There's a world where there's no supper for me. There's a world! It's fine, I don't need supper. It's fine. It's fine. I'm being ungrateful. Bullish already bought me coffee today. That's fine. Uh, Trapovic, thank you. Um, let's see. I don't know if you talked about it or not. What did you think the roomies? Well, it's 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 Ray and Leslie. We weren't all in there, <laughs> but um. I thought it was amazing. I, can't, I The thing is, like, I can't go on and react to stuff because I already saw it in bed. I was like, like this. I saw it and it was amazing. It was incredible. I was, I was so shook. To be clear, I hear Leslie sing all the time in my room because we're quite close. But, uh, like, we, we are physically within close proximity. So I hear her sing a lot. So it's no surprise to me. But Ray is also, I, as, like, I never hear her sing really that often, so it's always a treat when I hear both of them singing around. Are you doing better at letting people in your room? Yeah. 
I am, I think. Some of you may have noticed that I let four boys into my room. Which is horrifying, but I did it. <laughs> four of them! <laughs> It was really, I was like, a little stressed. Um. Also, the, no one just, no one used any of the, 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 the chairs that I have. Like, no one likes my stool or my rock, so I'm like, do I have to get more seating? I, <laughs> I, I don't know. Oh, wow. Um, you didn't freak out when Etwell went in yesterday? To be clear, I invited him just for a little, just to say bye. Um, but I've just been getting better. A lot of exposure therapy, like, I've just been inviting people in even when it's really messy. And then, um, I just feel better. Cause I'm like, oh, like, this is good. Oh, I hate this. What in the world is happening here? Like, just no thought process to how this is working. Okay, I have an idea. What if I... To make this little shape work, it's tied here. Yeah, okay. And then a little earring. Um, let's see. Oh, wow. I've been a fan of this song. I've got a, a couple new songs under my roster, guys. But it's because I've been listening to my Discover Weekly a lot more. You know, I feel like it helps me discover new songs a lot. Um, I don't know what I'm- what song is it? It's called Treat You Better by The Criticals. We can crank it a little. <clears throat> um... What the- what? What? Wait, I get my fake cigarette. This is bad, I shouldn't be promoting this. <laughs> Instantly in the chat, you're so cool. <laughs> you're so cool. Dude, I, I remember when they, <laughs> When they brought these out, like, <laughs> when they brought these out on Name Your Price, <laughs> my mom instantly texted me, and my mom and I do not talk to each other that often. Like, we do not commonly, like, we don't, we don't message that much. We don't, we don't talk that much. We message each other once every, like, three months. But I, w I was on Name Your Price, and this is the first one that I was on, not the Miami one, and I had this in my mouth, and I was, like, puffing it, because these ones have like fake smoke that come out and she was like why are you smoking because like that was like a huge no because like my dad would smoke so it was like a really big like mm -mm, not allowed like you're not allowed to do this like dude i was banned from a lot of stuff that my uh dad partook in as a child and one of these was soda my family was a really big well, my parents were really big Diet Coke people. <laughs> so my mom got addicted to Diet Coke. Like my 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 Korean mother. 
uh, yeah. And so I was like, <laughs> and so my mom was like, you are not allowed to have any soda, like, ever, like, you're not allowed to have soda, no smoking, not allowed, like, da da da, -da. and I was just like, okay. And so now I actually don't like soda, really. Because it's too- the bubbles are too spicy, <laughs> like, they're- they, like, hurt so bad, I don't know. And I like spicy food, but it just, like, it hurt- it's like a physical, like, it's popping really aggressively. It's a little spicy. And it makes me burp a lot, and I'm like, I just- But the coffee... My mommy, she has a passion for coffee, so that was allowed. actually encouraged me to take my barista course. I don't know, my mom isn't like, um... <laughs> my mom, I think when you hear of stereotypical Asian parents, right? I think my mom was very forgiving. Very forgiving. But I know it's because she had it really tough when she was young. So I think she really tried to break the cycle, you know? Yeah. So, my mom was really supportive when I said I wanted to draw growing up. When I wanted to, uh, be a- Dude, did every- every young girl also want to be a marine bi biologist? Like, you also wanted to, like, take care of dolphins and shit, like- <laughs> I feel like everybody wanted to be a marine biologist when they were younger. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I'm gonna be a marine biologist. I'm going to take care of the dolphins and I'm gonna save the whales. And, and I was like, wait, I, that's a, uh, it's, it's probably a bit much for me, but it was something I wanted to do at one point in time. I love like drawing short hair on girls but I don't typically like to draw like I guess guys and I don't understand why it works that way in my brain like I feel like when I draw guys I want to draw them with like super long hair and when I draw girls I want to draw them with like no hair <laughs> I just appreciate that kind of design I guess I suppose Listen, sometimes you do it an experiment, okay? And it's a bad one. Like, that little strand. Yeah, absolutely not. Okay. Um. You have the playlist? <laughs> I I know have. I'm so sorry. I know have that neck. Okay. <laughs> Listen. It's a, it's a little exaggerated, okay? Um when it comes to art, I tend to draw a lot of stuff that I I uh I was like, "Damn, I kind of want a neck like that." And sometimes I'll draw it, and that's kind of why I draw boobs a lot, I think. I don't have them. I just don't. Ah!
I just had a vision. You guys know how Foolish has an oral fixation? What if I just gave him one? Uh, an oral fixation is when you can't, um, guys, it's when you keep putting stuff in your mouth. It's when you keep putting stuff in your mouth. Like, like forks and straws. Oh my goodness. What is that reaction? Can you relax? What the fuck? Hello? <laughs> what the hell? Oh my, it, oh my goodness gracious. That is like the worst thing you guys have ever. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh my God. That's your fault, not mine. You have international viewers. Okay, that's my bad, I guess. Okay, an oral fixation is when you tend to put a lot of like, little things so like for instance if you give him a drink he'll just like bite like the stirrer a lot or like and so i had this and i was like oh what if i gave him one of these you know it would be funny for a day is what i meant is what i meant oh my god i'm so i'm so tense right now i'm so tense that was such a that was such a weird thing you're making me wish this was real. You're making me wish it was real. Oh. Okay. Oh, good heavens me. Um. Um. Oh, thanks, Cell Loves. Thank you. Wow, more than three years. That's crazy. Thanks for explaining. Hey, no problem. <laughs> no problem. Oh, God. Dude, I'm like... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm... I'm actually flabbergasted. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Um... Uh, uh, blue muffin. Thanks for the 27 months. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I should make her wear a halter top. You're right. Drawing with you guys is so fun because I get fun little ideas and I love it. To be honest. Okay, I'm gonna erase her boobs and I'm starting from scratch. Okay. Uh, since when do you smoke? Oh God, it's rolling in. It's rolling in. I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna get in trouble. <sighs> Mom, if you see this. Less than three love you. Um, oh, Marty thinks of the five months. Oh, how do I say this? Um, Oma, Tambe, Anhesoyo, okay? Um, Kega, Jonan? No more Chakeo, okay? Kind of. All right, I'm good. Oh. Chicky's oh. Donated ten dollars. <laughs> it's okay. We can fix it. Don't fret. Chat on three. We collectively erase this incident from our minds. Sticky starfruit. Thank you, but forget. It, it's not an incident. I didn't even say anything wrong. I didn't say anything. It's the phrasing, oh. Oh, he's the thanks to the 16 months. Do you guys want to go through my Discover Weekly with me and like maybe see Discover new songs? I have until Monday until it refreshes and I'm scared. Um, but oh. We can roll back a few songs that I personally really d liked that I found um, through the Discover Weekly. Guys, listen. 
you know, my house, they're really, they're really nice to me. And they're like, all right, Tina, play up the jams. So I guess you could say I'm a bit of a DJ myself. You know, I really, um, I really create um, some ambiance in the house sometimes. It's like kind of my job sometimes, you know. Graphic, thanks to the five gifted. Thanks, Graphic. Thank you, because we have like speakers in our house. So, so I play like little tunes um, to try to set the mood or if everybody's like, um, Honestly, I'm bad when there's too many people over, though, because I'm like, oh, like, this is not, I can't set the vibe for everybody, but, oh, Alibaba, thanks for the three months, but I've been playing this one a lot. I call this one uh, a song for, for Myung because she drives me to places everywhere. I was like, Myung, this is your song. <laughs> Oh my god, my arm just twitched. Oh, I'm drawing the armpit fat wrong. There's a muscle here, and it kind of connects there, and then it goes out this way. Don't know. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. Oh my god, thank you. What the heck? Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, if you don't if you don't know way you should. <laughs> Wait, Keith. She well, um they they basically like make really good art. <laughs> um so so do check them out. If you've got the time of day, um, they're really good at drawing. Really good. Really good. Uh, oh, whoa. Why is my camera auto-focusing? Have you told the blasting bad romance at 3 a.m. when waking up? Uh, I don't know. Have I, guys? I just see other people telling stuff and posting things before I get to it. Because, like... Dude, I'm such a Tina time person when it comes to streaming, posting, anything related to my life. So when they talk about it, I'm like, well, I mean, there it is. I don't have to say anything anymore. Like, <laughs> it just, I'm like, all right, cat's out of the bag. Like, I didn't even have time for that one. Like, I was like, I thought, I thought, you know, okay, listen, I, I could tell the story a little bit. I could tell the story. I'll put this song on quiet and play it in the background again because it's really good. But <sighs> I will say I was drunk on the home ride in the Uber. Okay. I was drunk. And um I was a little queasy because I listen, it I I had taken a break from drinking for a while, okay? I, I took a break because <laughs> It was get, a little unhealthy. I just, listen. Stop. Don't drink so much. Stop. Don't do it. Because you know what? It's not good for you. No, look at me. Okay. Oh, <gasps> graphic. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Thank you, graphic. Thank you so much. Thank you. Flowers for graphic. Rise. Um, Fuller City was so done. I. Listen, I don't know. I just, uh, okay. I was really drunk on the uber ride home 
Okay. I was a little nauseous. I was a little queasy. I think it was all my fault. What? You think Foolish had anything to do with that? I play Gaga. That's me. <laughs> Why would he be the one? That's crazy. Of course it was my fault. And so I was I was queasy on the ride home. And listen, I was really getting the like. I was making my like our Uber driver nervous, to be honest. Um, and I don't want to be that passenger. You know what I mean? I've never puked in an Uber, never. And I tell me you're not really smoking. It's fake. It's fake. It was a fake one. I'm gonna put it in the title. I'm gonna put it in the title. It w was. It was a fake cigarette. Okay, I'm okay. There we go. I'm putting it in. Okay. Um so I was I was drunk in the Uber and <laughs> um I dude, I was so scared the moment the moment I was like, "Wait a second. Ooh, like if if, if somebody like screenshots it, people would be like, "I didn't know she smokes." I was like, "I trusted her." <laughs> I was like twitches. And, oh my god anyways so i was drunk in the uber and then i was i was i was i was breathing a little heavy listen i breathe heavy even when um i'm sober because i'm like like sometimes i forget to breathe so i, I gotta do one of these and then i look like i look <laughs> i look like i have asthma um and then so i uh i was just breathing heavy in the back seat because i was a little nauseous and i was like and then the guy didn't say a word, just grabbed a plastic bag from the back seat and then like gave it to me. And I was like, no, no, no. He thinks I'm one of those girls and now I'm going to stress him out because because I'm going to stress him out. I'm going to make him upset. And so I was like, no, no, no. Like, I, I can't. I can't be that girl. I can't get that bad Uber rating. Like, this is terrible. So I was like, I don't know. I was just hearing him talk. I was just I was just like, I was like, I need to look for my way in. And then. I don't know, we were just like all talking. Cause like Uber drivers go through some shit. They really do. And so I um and I hate I hate being a bad passenger. Like I'll buckle my seatbelt. I'll be like, thank you for the ride. Thank you for picking me up. Have a nice day. Like, you know what I mean? So I I I was like really nervous that I was like upsetting him because I don't even like to I don't want him to have to hand me the bag. Like if I need a bag, I wanna politely ask for it, you know? So that at least they know that I'm trying to be considerate. But to be handed the bag, he was like, oh god, he thinks I'm like belligerent. So I was like, okay. I was just looking for my in. I was talking to um, I was talking to Foolish and LM. I was just I was just chatting away. And he says something. He says the word like clan. And I was like, I'm in. This guy's a gamer. And so I started dropping like little like I was like, I was like, yeah, like. I, I played World of Warcraft one time. I was like, I wasn't that good at it though, you know? Like, I, I definitely played like other MMOs when I was younger because I, I just think the $15 a month fee was a bit high for me when I was young. But, you know, I really enjoy just talking about games the entire time and he gets excited. He, he like joins in on the conversation and we're really like bonding now. <laughs> and I was like, this is good. This is good. And, and, and then, oh, and then I was just... <laughs> I was even like talking about Valorant at one point. I was like, "Oh, oh, foolish! You're really good at this game, aren't you?" Like, <laughs> and I was just like, "Yeah, you're really good at this game." Like, I was like, you know, but I, I could probably help Frank. I was just, I was trying to say anything, anything. I was like, I was like, please like me. And I also said, "I'm so sorry, sir. I don't feel sick. I just breathe heavy, and I promise I won't throw up in your car. I've never done it before." I don't do that. I, I always, um, I always throw a before or after, never during. <laughs> and he was like, okay, I understand. You just gotta understand, you know, people, people, um, get crazy in here. And I was like, okay. Oh, Finicky, thanks for the 27 months. So, um, basically as we we're getting dropped off, the last song that plays on the radio, cause he cranks it up for me while we were on the way and i was like wait i love this song do you think you could crank it up please and it was bad romance and i only got to listen to 30 seconds of it and i didn't want to like you know just sit in his car so when, when i got home i was like man i really want to listen to it but at this point i was just like dude I, my, I was like spinning and so then 
I just played it and then I lost my phone. And it was on the speakers really loud, but I was swirling around in circles, having the time of my life. Cause I was like, oh my God, I love this song. This is my, this is my childhood. I can imagine the bathhouse music video now. This is amazing. Like to be clear, Bad Romance is the type of song where if you play it on in atmospheric speakers and you just have like the whole room surrounded by it, when she does like the, uh, like, I don't know how to explain it part, but like when she's like singing her whole chorus thing, it just sounds heavenly to me. I like, it sounds so good. But listen, I understand that after the third or the second, the fourth or the fifth time, maybe it was a bit much. And maybe it was three in the morning. And I apologize because at that point in time, it was my world. <laughs> but I also lost my phone and I did try to find it and I couldn't find it. It was, it was wedged somewhere. Um... But, but Leslie said that she fell asleep when, um, I played, um, this song, which is, I like to call it our, our house's theme song now, because I play it so much. So she said this song put her to sleep. Yeah. It's a very vibey song. So, that was my story, and, um... Elam and Foolish were like this, like, they're like, I, d I honestly didn't notice that I kept playing until they're like, why is this song still on? <laughs> like, they were, so they like snapped and I was like, oh, you're so right. So I, I don't know. I don't know. You know what? Bless patient boys. Bless them because I'm a lot. I'm a lot. I'm a lot. However, at least you guys know that. Hey, good vibes in here, man. Oh, Tina, best girl. Thanks for the 28 months. Thank you. Um, but you know, it was. Oh God. Oh heavens. Let me turn this. And perhaps some chapstick. My heavens. Okay, wait. I'm gonna grab a chapstick. One second. Oh my god, my, my purse has like five lipsticks in it right now. Five! Um. It had five. Is it freestyle? Oh yes. It is. Hmm, okay. Oh, wait, guys. No, I guess I could keep playing it. But I know the song's copyright. Uh, oh, Rue, six to the four months. You know, sometimes when I have a lot of, um, forehead acne, I almost feel like I should embrace it by pulling all my hair back. I feel like I always hide my round face with my tendrils. Like this. I'm like, hey guys, I totally don't have a round face. I'm Megan Fox. But in reality, I'm Humpty Dumpty. Um... So, there's a world where sometimes maybe this would be like, like better. Uh, yeah, perhaps not. I call my round face my cherub face. It also gets bigger if I eat salty food. <laughs> if I have like too many uh, salty fries and like chicken tenders, I start to swell a little bit because of all the sodium, you know. But, um... I, I don't know. It's it's nice being a cherub. It's fine. I, I, it's you know it's 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 good. It's just Los Angeles has a lot of these ones, you know, and I'm like this one. Um, let's see. Your face is not round. It is. I don't know what it is about this webcam that makes it look like my face isn't round, but 
That's quite... That is round. Oval, maybe? It is round, though. It's definitely not like this. Um... Everyone said that they were surprised that my webcam had such high quality. And it's all lighting, really. Um... <sighs> um... What was I doing? I don't remember. I forgot. Oh! The reason why I full cammed was because I wanted to open my QSMP cube that you also can purchase. I was not asked to do this. Um, I all- I'm just doing it because I thought it would be fun. Um, I just thought it would be a fun time. You guys could get this yourself if you like the project. Oh, I'm op I'm trying to open it. Where's my box cutter? Oh, box cutter, where are you? Where are you? Where are you, little guy? I can't find you. Okay, well, it's gone, I suppose. That's ridiculous. I could have sworn it was around here somewhere. That's so strange. Well, that's bizarre. Um... Okay, I'm opening it. Ugh! Okay. I bricked up the box. But it's because my box cutter is just so tough to find. I've actually already seen this before. But I would like to show you. I feel like it's it's kindly packaged. It's kindly packaged. It's where you left it last. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Delivered t-shirt. Thank you. It's a fun one. I, I go to sleep in this shirt a lot. It's a nice shirt to sleep in. I'm opening the tape. Oh. Oh, good morning. Oh, and happy one year. Srugumi. Happy one year. What the heck? Oh my goodness. Woo! Wow. Beautiful. It's actually got quite good attention to detail. I'm surprised something like this exists because it's, um, this looks tough to mold and put together. You know what I mean? <gasps> I'm like so scared. Oh. It's got, yeah, like I feel like when you have some, like, look at that tiny ship. Like that feels like it's kind of hard to do. And these pegs in between, like, I feel like that's good quality. And I, I feel like I'm usually a stickler for stuff like this. You know what I mean? Like, I don't... I don't... I... I don't like it when figurines look like garbage. And this is... This is, like, really well made. I guess it's good. You know what I mean? It's good quality. So I really like it. Oh, thank you, QSMP. For all the friends I've made. For all the friends. Ow! What the heck was that? What is this? Okay. I guess I'll never know. Where shall I put it? Maybe I should put it like... Uh, maybe, uh, I'll put it by a cup, cause like, I don't want it to get damaged by like, there, you can barely see that, but that looks fine, uh, okay, that looks good. Very cute. Little Easter egg. Um. Okay. 
Ugh. Yeah. It's it's just a little Easter egg. Is that the mama? Mama gooseneck. Uh oh, the kettle. Um, I don't remember exactly what brand, but it is. And I will say for someone that doesn't make pour over coffees, it's kind of in it's not very convenient for me. But once I do do pour overs, it'll be convenient. Is this song still playing? How come you guys didn't tell me? Jesus, I, I Surely it played for like two hours just now. We reached four months Tinaki chat. You guys gotta say Bolinor. something, what you Tinaki did. <laughs> oh, Audrey, thanks for the four months. Thank you. Oh, wow. It is a great song, but it's also a long one. It's five minutes. And the fact that it already looped and it's half more than halfway through is, is shocking to me. It's shocking. Uh, I found three songs today. We're running them back. If you must ask, I'm testing to see which ones strike me. <laughs> this one is called I Did Drugs For You by Rook Monroe. Um. All right, okay, and then we'll run it back. Oh, wait, I also wanted to show you guys this PR package I got. I got a package from from Peter Thomas Roth. Oh, what? Oh, oh, thanks, thanks you, little waffle. Thanks you, thank you, little waffle. Thank you. Um, listen, I don't know if I'm. The thing is, like, I didn't expect him to point out that I was there, cause like, I think we just like to hang out afterwards, you know. But. <laughs> So I was just sitting there in the background quietly and I was just like doing my own thing because I was like, I'm just gonna frick off for like an hour. Oh, confused, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, so I was like, oh, I'm just gonna chill out and not do anything. Um, so that's what I did. And then he was like looking at me and I was like, I I was like, I didn't know it was gonna be a part of this. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> like, but it was like a little scary. Anyways, it's not speaking anymore. Goodbye. But they sent me, they sent me face creams, and I was like, oh my god, I'm excited. But when I opened the box, it started speaking, and it scared me. I was so scared. And I was like, I didn't know they did that these days. But I am excited to like, use it. Cause, oh my God. Oh my goodness, go inside. Go in, go in, go in. How would, the, how did this box even get in there in the first place? Oh my God. Okay, that's fine. I'll deal with that later. <sighs> Drawing time. Oh. Uh, let's see. When is, what is the supper? I don't know. They said I have to stream three hours if I want supper. That's what they said. <laughs> Shelby, thank you for the 17 months. And I was like, what are you saying? I, <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay. This song is also good. I dedicate this to you, Baji. <laughs> called Satan Loves You by Chloe Duquette. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> um, let's see. And that's in character. <laughs> oh, it was funny. Dude, I don't, I don't know the actual lyrics, but the title, uh, I thought was funny. It made me think of her. Um, oh. Um, I will just say this also as a passing thought. 
just because I don't know if I ever discussed it uh, like properly. But um, please never get angry at Baji on my behalf, ever, ever, ever. Cause like that girl is so nice to me and so respectful of my boundaries and always checks up on me and always makes sure what she's doing is like fine or okay. Um, and I feel bad because I, I can't read like, um, I don't, I don't read, por I don't understand Portuguese and I, so I don't see a lot of stuff. I don't, um, I don't get to read everything all the time. So if something, something annoying is happening, happening to her, like, uh, I might miss it. And I just feel, I don't know, like, I would never want anyone to, like, be mean to her on my behalf because they think that I would get upset over something. Because I know my boundaries and she knows my boundaries. Um, and also, I feel like she's just never, she's just never made, like, any joke towards me that... Well, first of all, I... <laughs> I don't even, that wasn't even like a joke towards me. It was just, she was just saying something random, but it was just kind of like a, she's just, I don't know. She's never said anything like, she hasn't even said a fraction of what like most guys would say and also get away with in that situation in terms of like, like promiscuous jokes, right? So I think, um, listen, we, we got to take care of our girls, you know? take care of the girls in the community because it's hard it is it can be exhausting especially because i think like when you have like a strong personality like baji right and you are outspoken about your thoughts and things like that like people get mad <laughs> like like it's a known proven fact that anybody in the spotlight when they're a woman, they love you when you're quiet. Like, like you're not allowed to be loud like other guys. You know what I mean? So, um, all I ask is that you just drown it out with, with kindness, you know? Like, if you see people being mean to her, you, you double up on how nice you are. You drown it out, you know? You don't participate in bullshit, you drown it out and you're kind. You're kind, double kind, to compensate for, for the evil. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. She's, she's a good gal. She's very sweet. So, I just, um, it, it's, you know, this is like partially for her, but also with just like, you know, oftentimes, like, I feel like girls in spaces like this can, can get, you know, the short end of the stick. All I ask is for the benefit of the doubt and a little fun exercise is uh, sometimes you would be like, would I get this upset if I, and then you like imagine a guy saying it, like would I give this person the benefit of the doubt if I just expected that they were a dude saying all this? Like a lot of the times you kind of would, you know what I mean? And like a lot of people are, listen, you can say, you can say that you're a feminist, you can say this and this, but ev people are accidentally misogynistic all the time. Like, sometimes I'll make a comment where I'm like, oh, I feel like that was a little bit, like, ignorant or misogynistic of me. But you just, you Thank fix you it. Awesome. You just rewrite things in your brain. You're like, okay, like, I know that that's, like, maybe not great, so I won't say it again. And then you just change and you grow, and the easier you make that process for yourself, and the less judgmental you are about it in other people, the less judgmental you can be about it to you and then everybody grows and it's really easy and it just gets done so you know it's just uh normalizing how uncomfortable it can be to recognize your own personal flaws and growing you know uh, oh keely thank you for the two months yeah like uh, accidents do happen you know like like you could know you could be you can know everything but um mistakes happen and allowing mistakes to happen can help other people grow and it can make the world a better place <laughs> so yeah that's just my little 
little tidbit, little rant. It's not particularly needed at the moment, I would say, but um, it is one that is always a good reminder, you know? And it, it does break my heart when I don't know, like, like, maybe, like, a girl would, like, come to me and, like, like, maybe, I don't know, just feel a little bit distressed about something, because, listen, if, if anything, I will give girls benefit of the doubt. Like, I'm not gonna be like, whoa, why would you do that? Like, I will always double check and ask and set my boundaries and make things comfortable. You know what I mean? Like, that's, like, that's my job to express, like, my comforts. You know? Uh... Yeah. And I know, I know people have, um, good intentions, you know? But sometimes I do think they can be misguided. So I'm just here to guide. As I, as I do. I ran out of coffee. <laughs> No. Oh. Ah. ah, refreshing. What, what happened? I missed it. Just two more hours and I can give you dinner. That's crazy! Oh god. Wait, did you all type that message? That was all of you. That's crazy. I can't believe this. Just two more hours, guys, and I can earn supper. Just two more hours. <laughs> Just two more hours and supper is earned. Um... Okay, there we go. You know, I feel like subtleties make a big difference when it comes to drawings. Like, I feel like that looks way better than what I had going on before. Could he made actually good or poisonous? I did not eat it. <laughs> um. Um. I'm a girl yet. I feel like I'm more accidentally misogynistic than feministic. Honestly, like it. Um. It. it it's. Uh, mindsets like this take practice. You know. Like I wasn't always. I don't know. Like, there, there are definitely plenty of times in my youth where I've, like, betrayed womankind for male approval. Like, I was, I'm, I was seven, so I forgive myself, <laughs> but, <laughs> you know, like, that just, it's, it's all, it's about learning, growing, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, it happens, you know what I mean? Like, you just, you... It's, it's all about learning. And also, you know, like, once you learn, you can't be like, oh, because I know it, everybody should. Like, some people just aren't in that environment. <sighs> you know? Um... But I will say, like... Having this knowledge can be a burden sometimes because once you realize that like so much is a little bit like wrong, right? Or like so much of it feels wrong.
down because you've been taught that anything to do with it is just terrible, you know? Um. Uh. Hmm. Nowadays, when I see a girl only have guy friends and no female friends, I do side eye them because to me it feels like. I think that takes learning though. Like, you know, like I think even if a girl is in a position where I'm like, oh, she's just, she hasn't done that, that growing yet, that internalized learning that she's got to do. Um, I don't know. I just let them go on their journey. You know what I mean? I let them do their, their own thing. Like, I, I, I do understand when, like, certain actions can be disappointing, but... I don't know, I, it's... I don't think it's ever intentional. Okay... Oh, maybe I wanna... Yeah, one of those? Actually... Um, um, uh, mm. yeah, I think, you know, everyone can benefit from, like, allowing a feminine side to them, you know? It just makes you all the, um... Especially because, like, upholding things that are traditionally masculine can be, like... I don't know. It can lack empathy. <laughs> you know? Um, and empathy's good. And empathy... Being empathetic is logical. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You know? If you don't factor in emotions when you're talking about society as a whole, you are making illogical takes because emotions are a factor, period. Like, if you don't factor in how people will react to a certain thing because you lack empathy, you are illogical there. You are unable to make good decisions because you lack empathy. Like, it's just a fact. <laughs> you know what I mean? And people that try to act like emotions are illogical are very weird to me. Like, let, let, people that... People that act like emotions don't deserve a part or play a part into anything is very strange. Especially because a lot of the times the people saying this are emotional but just in a very different way and they are making decisions based on their own emotions. But they're not sharing them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, how are you doing? Um, oh, Grumpy Grinch, thanks for the three months. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's just one of those. You know, I do think it's possible to make bad decisions and be, like, not be so logical when you have emotions that are not regulated <laughs> like i will definitely be a little crazy and not have regulated emotions so i'm like okay obviously i can't make logical decisions right now but um you know <laughs> i think we know what i'm talking about when i'm talking about like very specific people that do this you know what i mean that try to dismiss people's emotions by saying that they're not logical uh minister thank you for the hello. Hi. Howdy. Hola. Howdy do. Um. Yeah. Oh, Polaris. That's a fun way to talk about a Polaris. That's crazy. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, the facts don't care about your feelings, people. Those ones. Uh, 
Oh. Okay. I think it would be better practice for me to try to, like, draw someone I know. Um... Let's see... Oh, this is incorrect. It just needs to be rounded out more. Okay.
So, and, and listen, like, I, I could be, I could feel alone in a crowded room, and I could be like, everybody hates me! But the fact of the matter is, like, hating yourself so much clouds your judgment. I, I have a problem with it. A lot of people do. So many people do. You know what I mean? It helps you, it like stops you from seeing what's actually there. <laughs> um, so you just gotta like, I don't know, you gotta start like doing things that you like, investing in your own hobbies, you know, finding like passion in things. Um, like really just enjoy life with yourself take yourself out on little dates you know like really enjoy being around you it's hard it's not easy it's easy to say it but it's something that you have to practice and you'll you might fall backwards you know you might like fuck up and you might be like wait a second like uh, I was doing so good I was loving myself so much but I'm back to square one that also happens you know you just gotta keep going you just gotta keep trying again and again what else are you gonna do anyways you know what else are you gonna do you might as well Uh, um, yeah, we keep swimming. We keep swimming. Oh, what the heck? There's surely a faster way to color. Like, what the hell is this? It takes too long. I just never, um, draw. I don't use the... My lines are never closed, so I feel like the bucket is always, like, bad for me. Um... You can trace the outline only in a new layer and use the bucket. Oh, uh, I guess I could. I guess I could. There's a delay in my speech. Wait, is there? Actually? Oh. One guide, okay, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Um, yeah. Uh huh. Oh, I like the the disc for this one actually. Um, oh, actually, we'll make it more neon. Yeah. Oh, brick. Maybe I make it. Uh, the values. I don't understand colors. Oh god. Um maybe I'll put it here. Oh. Um Oh! Foolish! Thanks for the raid, man. Thanks, dude. And also, 
Thank you for the coffee this morning. It was tasty. Thank you. I finished all of it. Even though I got a large. Uh, Trill, thank you. Um. There are a bunch of sharks in here. It's shark territory now. Um. Oh. One year with Tinza. Oh my god. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Singus. Erica Moon. Rosley. Thank you. Oh, hola. Oh, hello. Hello, doozers. Hope everything's good. Hope everything's fine and dandy in your neighborhood. Hope everything's fun. We're just, you know... Um... What are we doing? We were talking about, a uh, Feminism. <laughs> feminism. And also, we were talking about how... Um, you could feel alone in a crowded room if you hate yourself. <laughs> just a mixture of things. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, real. Yeah, just one of those days. Actually, not really. I think it was prompted by like a chatter. Today's a good day for me. <laughs> I'm having a good one. I'm hoping it stays that way. <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's always a mixed bag. Yeah, that's fine. This arm just doesn't make any sense. Like this is like, I, it's just a big log. Where are the muscles? Like, what are they doing in there? Ah, uh, Bayleaf, thanks for the 14 moths. Um, oh. Um. Uh. Let's see. Um. Oh, I guess I can just color over this part. <sighs> I think one of my New Year's resolutions is to learn how to draw hands and feet. <laughs> and it's... It's almost the end of February and it's looking rough. The one I'm the most concerned about is the TikToks, to be clear. Oh, comic! Another sub birthday! Yay! Oh, thanks for drawing with me, comic. Thanks. I think it's um really fun to draw along people that are drawing. It's a fun time. Dare I say you guys get the better end of the stick because, you know, you don't get the judgment potentially. <laughs> if you don't think you're doing good, there's like, you're not gonna get a... I love the colors you use when drawing tins of Tinaki Oh! Thank you, what the heck? That's really nice. Um... All right, let's see. Is that Ramona Flowers? It's not, but you know, I've seen a good amount of people um, saying, saying it. Uh, oh, how do you connect your iPad, your uh, the stream? Reflector 4. Um. Yeah, Reflector 4 is the way to go. Um... 
Ugh. Okay. <sighs> is this Ross Lynch? Oh, it is. Oh no, these are the nine months, and Julius Navi thinks it's the fifteen months. I don't know what this era is. R five. But I love this song in my youth. I thought it was awesome. I was like, wait, this is a great song. Uh, let's see. Ah! Um, Uh Okay. R5. Wait, that those are his siblings? Oh. Interesting. Wait, that's wholesome. That's quite cute, actually. Oh, yes, siblings and one friend. I think like wh one of my larger regrets is um, like 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 definitely saying like hi, but not actually speaking to this person because I, I I like had a chance. I was gonna be like hello, or like, uh, but I think it's like I hate being in situations where there's there's somebody there at a, at a situation and. You, you know who they are, and you don't want to feel weird. And so I'm, I was just like, I was like, hello, hi, doing good, how are you, okay, bye. I, that, it makes my, it makes my eyes bleed. It makes my eyes bleed. <sighs> um, hmm, let's see. <laughs> Chatters when they see their fave streamers. Well, <laughs> okay, we'll play tunes. I'm discovering new music. Wait, I feel like this one's already starting off really well and strong. I'm liking this. I feel like I'm enjoying this. Okay. Oh. Oh, pop up for it. Thanks for the four months. Thank you. Okay. I'll maybe make this more full tone. Oh. Wait, I feel like that's actually like working for some reason. What? Why? Why is that working? like borderline purple maybe it's because of the color of her hair and it's like that's how light is working in this moment oh okay Oh god, I, I wouldn't know what to say for the best friend advice thing, Chatter, because, like, that's, like... Uh, I, I don't know. I think that's one of those situations where you just kind of have to know if they like you back before, you know? Like, you, I feel like you just have to know. 
Um. I feel like the purple actually worked, but I don't know why. Why is it look not so bad? I would like to know. Interesting. Um, um, let's see. Color theory is fake to me. I just pick whatever looks it. I see. Yeah, I don't understand color theory like at all. It sucks. about the smudge tool oh what I'm so lost why is it watercolor what is happening what if I make it an airbrush tool uh, oh I don't under I don't know Coloring really like I just Oh Interesting Have you ever listened to the academic I think you would like them I don't think I have Right now, I'm just, um, running through a bunch of songs. Discovering new songs is always, like, it takes time because songs are long. But when you find good ones, it's nice. you out and about downtown um i don't know i've been out and about a little too much lately i think i need to relax i need to chill out Oh, 
Um. Before you went live, you're watching B and Puppy. Can you love it? Oh my god! I love to hear it. I always find it very questionable when I spend this much time rendering boobs above anything else. It's just an interesting choice, really. But it's fine. I'm just like, hmm. <laughs> like, very nice, lovely, wonderful. Thoughts about Pete's drawing vid? I, uh, I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it. I think he can do... Oh, I just watched. I saw something. Whoa. Um. <laughs> I'm sorry to say this, but her head reminds me of Tubbo. Oh! A tele art was fun. I remember it. Oh, maybe more like lighter. Oh. rendering okay damn person talking about me um Honestly, I don't usually render like this, so I don't know what I'm doing. I, like, I don't think I ever, like, mess with airbrush to this extent. And I also feel like the more rendering you do, like, you just have to know more, and I just don't know that much. Um... Oh. Uh, 
okay. I feel like this song's kind of nice. I don't know. I'm kind of a fan. It's quite good. Oh. Oh. Wait, now it definitely looks like Ramona if I do it like that. Um. Um. Okay. Send a picture of me, and we all wanna know where you've been. Uh. Cause it's been so long, I'm thinking it's time that you come home again. Send a picture of me, and we all wanna know where you've been. Um, um. No. I'll think about it. Color do I want her shirt? And also, is that a nipple? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if that's a nipple. And if there is a nipple, why is it only on one side? Hmm. Ah, uh, Simmer, thanks for the eight months. Thank you. Dark turquoise. That's a great idea. That's not turquoise. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Uh, I'm gonna pick a different color, but for now I'm just filling it in. Um 
I've changed the lines here. So it feels more halter toppy. I have the power to do so. The green is pretty, but it doesn't go. I don't like the green. I'm actually just filling it in and changing it. See, I do a little alpha lock here. I go here. Oh, and then I can do like a... One second. Like so. Uh, Carol, great thanks for the four months. Thank you. Um. Uh. I also like the idea of her just wearing gray, but like a blue gray. one okay um Dumb Jenny, these are 26 months. That's the new song. It's called Nine Stories by Hazel English. Ninth floor. So true. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Don't want that one. Like, who is this person? Why do I keep drawing people I don't know? It's just, it's way better to draw stuff that like, people be like, oh, I know who that is. But then someone sees us and they're like, what is that? I'm like, I don't know. Sure, I've tried and still don't get it. 
I just get bored of shading and stuff, honestly. Oh wait, this is a song that I added this morning. I was like, why is it so familiar? <laughs> but I've played it this stream so many times already. Spotify overlay, yeah, there's a world. And then eraser with an airbrush tool. Do a little zhuzh, 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 zhuzh. And then, wait, we do, honestly, like, a more blunt, like, thing here. Just to differentiate the two. I'll change this to multiply. Oh. Multiply and then lower that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> mm. The song is depressing me. Jesus Christ. Um. I love that song. It it was fine. It was just depressing me. I was like, this is like making me upset. Like, oh. And that's, that's fine sometimes, but not right now. I don't want that. I need energy. Oh. Kylie, thanks for the 21 months.
That's haphazardly like, uh, colored, really. Mmm, well. I mean, uh, I don't know. know I just never know how to progress really um okay let's see oh this is like fun um Okay. Like, I don't understand. Wait, the instrumental kind of goes crazy here.
Can you play Nightcore too? I honestly could. I could. I'm not against it. Um. Giving me Ramona Flowers vibes. Yeah, it kind of just happened. Dude, I'm, it's getting that part of the the art stream where I'm just going non-verbal. Like I've just, I have no words, like nothing will come out. I don't know how to fix it. My mouth just seals itself. Uh. <laughs> oh, cat stare, it's okay. Um... on the top like what do you mean can you draw her with the laser what does that 
What? What? What does that mean? her eyes Okay, I guess it's just in the song. I just feel like I like heard something. Ah! Oh jeez. Uh, not the voices. It's that time of night again. Okay. It is. It's in the song. It's like layering. Why is it doing that? This is not a Tina friendly song. <laughs> oh, wheeze. I hate when songs do that. It's just like local like voices in the distance, but it's so muffled. I'm like, hello, is anyone there? Um. I feel like the song's quite nice. I agree. Ah, uh, Sushi, so thanks for the two months. Thank you. Thank you.
points though. I think for channel points it could be kind of fun. Also the premise of me like not liking one of these songs but then you guys liking them makes me feel kind of bad. I'm like, oh, I want to skip it. Mind me, just combating mental warfare. Um, uh, oh, Alex, it's a five gifted. Thank you. That's very kind. Jerking. Dino dance for moss. Thank you. Um. Um, hmm. I feel like... Oh. For a while, I'm gonna make this normal just so I can grab the color and add it here. as well, honestly. Ugh. Okay, well. Um. Marceline, is it just you and me and the wreckage of the world? So I'm gonna go. I believe it's supper time. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> I guess. I suppose. It feels like kind of an abrupt, random end, but, um, you know. 
I don't know if same time tomorrow. I actually have no idea. Everything is up in the wind. I'm gonna raid, um... Uh, you know what? I'll raid Ems. I feel like it was her birthday recently and I didn't really get to, like, do that because I went live after her, maybe? That'll be fun. That'll be nice. And then, like, a lot of you are doozers, so it'll be nice for you. Okay, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow, potentially. Like, that's the goal, for sure. The goal is tomorrow, but who knows what the world has planned. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys sometime soon then. Goodbye, thanks for watching. Thank you, thanks for discovering new songs with me. Accompanying me on a drawing, um, listening to me talk about everything random little stuff you guys are the best take care have a wonderful sleep